Welcome back to Bourbon Country Reacts. Where's your glass? I have no freaking idea. I don't have it. We'll be back. Well, he'll be back. I'll still be here because we don't edit. Y'all get to see this shit. Shenanigans. Welcome back to Bourbon Country Reacts where Keith doesn't have a glass. But uh, we're going to listen to some country music and we've got a bribe. This is a bribe from Mark, right? Isn't that his name? Yeah, Mark sent us. Hey, look, it's your glass. You found it. I thought Marines lost everything. Uh, we lose stuff, we break stuff, and we impregnate things. Right. You found your glass. Is it pregnant? You'll have to have it tested, and I don't want to know. I don't want to know either. All right, so Mark sent us Barnstormer Distillery 40 Winks Double Barrel Whiskey. I've never heard of this distillery. I have not either. He says it's local to him, though. So, Bark from Illinois. Okay. All right. Uh, uh, so, he sent us kind of a list of songs. Yeah. And was like, pick one off this list. We just took the first one for a couple of reasons. One, it was first. Yeah. Two, it's Tyler Childers. And? We kind of like Tyler Childers. And? What? What? It's a live vinyl session. Yeah, well, it's... yeah. I mean, that that matters too. But Tyler, um, in our experience so far, I think we've done two of his songs, sings about things that are real. Like really, really real. Yeah, Charleston Girl was pretty real. And being from Charleston, I knew damn well how real and accurate that was. Right. So, um, yeah, I think this channel has turned me into a Tyler Childers fan. Um, and so the song that he requested is Nose to the Grindstone. Yeah. Off the uh, Our Vinyl Sessions. Um, haven't heard it. We've heard a couple of Tyler songs, but we haven't heard this one. Um, you ready to check it out? Heck yeah. Let's All right, go. Let's go. Uh, Nose to the Grindstone. It's got me already. Damn. It's got daddy worked like a mule mining Pike County coal. Yeah. He's talking about Pike County, Kentucky right there. Damn. And them's my people. Pull that back. <laughs> we got to start that over. Damn. Okay. I'm, I'm listening. I love the guitar too, man. It's so clean. Cool. Daddy work like a mule mining Pike County coal. He fucked up his back, couldn't work anymore. He said, one of these days you'll get out of these hills. Keep your nose on the grindstone and out of the bills. Damn. See the ways of this world just bring you to tears. Keep the Lord in your heart and you'll have nothing to fear. Live the best that you can and don't lie and don't steal. Keep your nose on the grindstone and out of the pills. Well, Daddy, I've been trying. I just can't catch a break. There's too much in this world I can't seem to shake. But I remember your words, Lord, that bring me chills. Keep your nose on the grindstone and out of the pills.
good as his word It takes twice as long to build bridges you burn And there's hurt you can cause Time alone cannot heal Keep your nose on the grindstone and out of the pills well, Daddy, I've been trying I just can't catch a break There's too much in this world I can't seem to shake But I remember your words Lord, they bring me to chill Keep your nose on the grindstone and out of the pills. Keep your nose on the grindstone. Holy hell. That is probably a new favorite song. Holy hell. Hell. Yeah. I didn't even think about my glass. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Oh my God, what a song. Yeah. Pro- like, I don't even know what to say. Oh, dude. The it was the I'm, vocals were so well delivered. And they the, gave you chills, the dude. The message in that song, man. Every holler in West Virginia, Eastern Kentucky, Southeastern Ohio, all, probably all up and down the Appalachian chains, man. This Should is be a an theme. anthem. It is. It an, anthem's a better word. It, yeah, it, it should sh- be a fucking anthem. I, I'm, I'm blown away. I, I want to hear it again. <laughs> I am almost tempted to just cue it back up. Y'all listen to it again with us. I mean, Shit, man. My God. Um, Mark, thank you. That was a damn good bribe. I feel like this, we should this, be bribing him. This is instant playlist, man. Instant. The, the, <laughs> you got lost for words. Because <laughs> everything about it was amazing. And it was so simple. It was a guy and his guitar. But it was amazing. I, I, I after after this video, I'm gonna need a few minutes to recover from this song. I'm not even kidding. Yeah, we, we should probably cue it up again and listen to it again. I don't know if that'll help. <laughs> I'm just saying, I want to hear it again. I, we, I think, we, let's do it. We're, we're gonna have to do that. Um, damn, I, I'm having trouble shifting gears. To the, to the glass, because I don't think I care. <laughs> right? We've had a we've had a few requests for this one. Yeah, I see why. No kidding, dude. Uh, yeah, I. I'm rattled, man. I'm. You know what's weird? I always get for some reason. I don't know why this is. It's just me being weird. But I always get Coulter Wall and this guy mixed up. Similar delivery styles. Raw, very raw. A a voice and a guitar, and that's it. Yeah, and totally different sounds. Because very Childers is more like deep. Yeah, and ultra real subject material. True, true. What? So this has to be a genre. So I think, folks, like it seems to sit like if you take a Venn diagram, you've got. Country, bluegrass, and Americana. Kind of like in the middle. And these guys are like right in the middle there somewhere where you can't really categorize them. Right. But man, are they making amazing music. I'm going to make a prediction that people are going to be listening to this song 100 years from now. They should be. There, There are some songs in history that you know are just going to last for 100 years. This is straight up. That, an apple. This should be an Appalachian anthem, dude. Because it, it talks about integrity, right? It talks about staying out of the pills it, and working your ass off. It's all of those Appalachian values, right? In one freaking song, yes. And all the Appalachian pitfalls in one freaking song. Crazy, dude. 
All right, I have to shift gears because we are bourbon country reacts. And I should be paying attention to the bourbon. Kind of an interesting nose on that. It is. It's an interesting... Is it a bourbon? I think it's a whiskey. It's a whiskey. I can't really describe the nose. You can smell some ethanol in there and a little bit of florals, but the florals are a little odd. Well, it's not, very light too. Not in a ba- yeah, it's a very light aroma, not in a bad way. I, all right, let's see what this tastes it's like. Got a good nose. It's interesting that it's double barreled. They sourced this. What the shit is that? So initially, oh my god. This is crazy complex. Yeah. So initially I get hit with cinnamon. I don't remember that. Hold on. While it's still sitting on the initial. Yeah. There is some absolutely delicious flavor there I cannot name. Almost like apple pie. I'm going to have to come back to it and try again. It's apple. But as it rolls uh, f- through the mid, it is super strong vanilla. Like crazy strong vanilla. Yep. And the finish is um, vanilla and I think a little apple and some oak. Some oak. I'm not sure if that's apple that I can't name. In the Let me try it again. I'm, I'm getting straight up apple pie. Not like apple pie moonshine stuff. That that's not. What, it's like a n- kind of a non sweet apple pie. You know, you got in my head when you said that, and I think you're right. It, but I'm I'm going to narrow it down more. Mm-hmm. So you're eating some apple pie. Okay. You take your fork. You grab a little crust. Yep. You grab a little apple pie filling. Yep. And you grab a little vanilla ice cream. Dude, it's it's apple pie a la mode. And the the but there's the so there's the butter in there that's yep. that's hard to identify. Yeah, yeah. Man, this is really good stuff. It's pretty tasty. I have no idea what he paid for this. I would pay probably seventy bucks for it. Yeah. Yeah, I think this is really good quality. So it's hand bottled by um, hand bottled hand, hand bottled by uh, Barnstormer Distillery in Rockford, Illinois, and it's distilled in California. I'm a little shocked that Californians can make whiskey this good. That was impolite. <laughs> <laughs> Not wrong. <laughs> Just impolite. <laughs> Just saying. Uh, so I'm gonna read this real quick. The marketing won't shit. Yeah. This is usually amusing. While our bourbon and whiskeys are resting, aka taking 40 winks, which is where they get the 40 wink. Uh huh. Yep. I see what they did there. Uh, we have personally selected a whiskey which is distinctively different, as it's been double distilled and double barreled in New American oak barrels. Our small batch release is part of the series, which will not be repeated. So this is a super special bottle. Yeah. So thank you. Well, and if you see it on the shelf, apparently snatch it up because it's not going to be there again. Or or let us know where it's at. We'll come get it for you. Yeah. For To protect you. Correct. You don't. This is terrible. It could and hurt you don't want to buy it. It could hurt your feelings. Right. How, what's your proof? I'm going to have to try it again. Hmm. I'm going to say 90. You hit it. Did I? You hit it right on the dot. I was actually going to, if I hadn't looked at it, so the initial that you get. My temptation was to go low. Mine was 80. But then as it starts to finish, it kind of turns the heat up a little bit. And you're like, yeah, it's a little hotter than 80. But it's still smooth. Uh, oh, yeah. Very smooth. Very drinkable. Very good. This is great stuff. Yeah. Apple yeah. pie a la mode in a bottle. Yeah. First time. Yeah. Legit. So, hey, guys, um, if you enjoyed this video anywhere near. We did. 
as much as we did. <laughs> yeah. Uh, at the very least, give us a like. Please subscribe to the channel. Drop down in the comments. Um, I'm interested. I haven't said this before. Uh-oh. I am very interested in your feedback on this song. Yes. I want to know what you thought of this song. Yeah. Were you as blown away by it as us? Or... I know a bunch of you have not heard this. Yeah. And I want to know what you think of it. Yeah. Let us know. Yeah. So, and tell us what other country songs we should check out, what North American whiskeys we should try. Or, I guess, send us a bottle. You could do that. Yeah. All right. Hey, till next time, guys. See you.